Hmm? Oh! Hey guys, sorry, didn't see there was just drinking this hot chocolate over here, but you guys probably know what today's video is going to be about since you read the title and since there's a wintry, you know, kind of scene going on behind me. So I'm doing another Christmas tag. I was actually going to be doing like a Christmas special this year, but uh, motivation <laughs> is not with me right now so yeah and also I might redo that into a different holiday special I just didn't have the time to and also motivation just didn't want to come to me so yeah but at least I'm doing something Christmassy this won't be my last video of 2022 there are like I think two or three videos I still have left to post but those should be coming either sometime this week or next week or already out so yeah but this might be like my second to last post for the year but i don't know yet so yeah but anyways can we all just agree that viper doesn't look like viper with this scarf on i swear he looks so weird but anyways not the point but we're going to do a Christmas tag. I try to find different Christmas tags every year. But I might have already done this one. But I'm still going to do it. It's 20 questions if you guys want to do this Christmas tag as well. I will leave the questions down in the description so you guys can do it as well. So yeah, anyways, further ado, let's get into it. Oh, also, before I start this tag as well, credit to whoever created this tag. I'm not entirely sure who did, but credit to whoever created this Christmas tag that I'm going to do. So yeah, all credit goes to them. I did not make this tag. Question number one. Use one noise to describe how excited you are for Christmas. Woo! Okay, yeah, I am excited for Christmas. So, yep. Christmas has to be probably my second favorite holiday because my first is definitely Halloween, but, you know, Christmas is a close second, so, yep. Okay, question number two. Do you open any presents on Christmas Eve? Yes, I do. I open some. Usually, I don't get a lot of presents since I'm a bit older but I do get money and sometimes I do get presents so most of the time I open them on Christmas Eve. I do know a lot of people open theirs on Christmas Day but I open them on Christmas Eve so yep. Question number three. What holiday traditions are you looking forward to most this year? Probably going to my grandparents because I go to my grandparents every Christmas Eve and probably singing Christmas songs with my family as well because we do that. My grandma plays the piano and we just, you know, sing different Christmas songs. So that's what I'm most excited for this year. Question number four. Is your Christmas tree real or fake? Our Christmas tree is fake. I do like real Christmas trees. The only bad thing about real Christmas trees is that usually they shed pine needles and you can find them like in February or March of next year. You could like find them. And also sometimes it's really hard to decorate a real tree because it's literally sticking into you so you're like trying to put because I've put ornaments on a real Christmas tree before and yes the pine needles want to like stick to you and they want to hurt you but I like both I do like the smell of like real pine trees but I prefer a fake one so yeah but we have a fake one Question number five, what is your favorite Christmas film? I actually have a lot of favorite Christmas films and sometimes they change each year, but I'm just gonna name my top three for now because I can't choose between these movies. 
The first one is Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. It's a classic. It's an amazing movie. I have seen that movie like a hundred times, but it's still a really, really good movie. The second one, I don't know if you guys ever heard of this one, but it's called The Search for Santa Claus. It's a really good movie. They made three movies about it. The first one is called The Search for Santa Claus. The third one is called Santa Buddies. And then the... I can't remember the second one. If I remember the second one, I'll put it somewhere during editing. But I can't remember it. I really can't at the moment. But it's a really good movie. I've read the book as well. They have a book about it. The book I got, it kind of showed like different scenes from the movie. But it's a really good movie. It's a really good Christmas movie. Love it. Definitely involves dogs. If you like dogs, you'll definitely love that movie. Or any animals, you'll definitely love that movie. It's a really good like Christmas film. All three of them are. And... Hmm. The Grinch Stole Christmas, probably. I watch it every year. I've watched the animated version and the human version. They're both amazing. So, yeah, definitely those three. Question number six. Where do you usually spend your holiday? So, Christmas Eve, we spend it with my grandparents and the rest of my family. And then Christmas Day, we just spend it together as a family. We don't go to my grandparents or anything. We just spend it at home with our family. So, yeah. Question number seven. What is your favorite Christmas song? This changes every year. I have a lot of favorite Christmas songs. So I'm going to name my top three again because I can't choose. So the first one would have to be Last Christmas. Definitely a really good song. Second one would probably have to be Silent Night because it is a really, really good song too. And then the third one would probably have to be... Probably Jingle Bell Rock, probably. I have like a lot of favorite songs. Probably every Christmas song is my favorite, but those are definitely like my top three for now. Question number eight. What is your all-time favorite holiday food slash sweet treat? Okay, so I have a lot, but I'm going to name two of them. The first one would have to be Red Velvet because... During Christmas, that's when the red velvet stuff comes out. Red velvet cupcakes and cake and stuff. I love red velvet. If you know me, I'm like a big lover of red velvet. It's a problem and it's an obsession. So yeah, but it's really, really good. And the second thing would probably have to be... Hmm. Probably have to be... The second one is definitely Rice Krispie Treats. I know you can make and eat Rice Krispie Treats all year round, but for some reason they just taste a lot better when they are made during Christmas. So yeah, they're really, really good and definitely recommend them. So, yep. Question number nine. Be honest. Do you like giving gifts or receiving gifts better? Hmm, I like both, but if I had to pick one, I would probably say giving gifts better because I love seeing people's reactions. I don't know why. I just love seeing like people's reactions when you give them a gift and to see like how excited they get and then their like reaction when you give them one. I like both. I like receiving and giving gifts, but I would have to probably say giving gifts is my favorite. Question number 10. What is your favorite thing about Christmas? I actually have two things I love about Christmas. The first one is seeing all the decorations, other people's decorations like on their house, and also decorating the inside and outside of your house as well. I love that. And then the second thing is seeing like family and spending time with family especially family that you don't see like so often so yeah question number 11 when do you start getting excited for christmas usually i start getting excited for christmas either before thanksgiving or like kind of after i'd probably have to say like 
before Thanksgiving. So yeah, probably like literally like a week after the starting of November, like I get excited. But yeah, Christmas is a very like exciting time. So yep. Question number 12. What is the best Christmas gift you ever received? So I have a lot of like Christmas gifts that I have received that are really cool, but I will probably say two of them. So the first one is the stuff that I got from my friend this year. If you didn't see that video, I will link it down below. But the favorite things that I got from there was probably everything, but definitely the shirt and the LPS, but I loved everything that I got. So yeah, probably those. And then my second one would probably have to be any LPS that I received during Christmas time because that definitely kind of fueled my addiction for LPS and like an obsession. But I love every gift that I get, whether it's money or an actual gift. So yeah, but those are my two favorites. So yeah. Question number 13. What is the worst present you have ever received? I actually don't know. I have no idea. I don't know. I love every gift that I get, so I don't really have an idea on like that one. So I guess I don't have like a worst gift I've ever received. Question number 14. As a kid, did a sibling ever receive a present that you wish was for you? Not that I can think of. I don't think so. I watched my brother like open Christmas presents and some of the stuff he got, I mean, it was pretty cool, but not that I really wanted it myself. So yeah, not really. So I don't really have one that I like wish was for me. So yeah, I had like, I got like dolls and LPS and different things for Christmas and yeah, but when my brother got something, no, I really wasn't like wishing it was for me because I really can't think. Maybe I did, but at the moment I can't remember, but maybe there was a time, but I don't really remember like a specific gift that he got that I wished was for me. So probably not. Question number 15, where would be your dream place to visit for the holiday season. Okay, so I have two places. I really want to go to like New York one time for Christmas because New York City looks so pretty. It looks so pretty during Christmas, like with the big tree in town square and everything. I know it's a very, very busy place during the Christmas season, but I would love to go there and just like, you know, see everything. I don't know, it's like a very, it, it just reminds me of like Christmas and probably also go like to the United Kingdom because I want to see my friends. So, yep, <laughs> just take me over there, like, please. Okay, yep. <laughs> Question number 16, most memorable holiday moment. Probably the first time I got an LPS for Christmas. I'll show a picture of the LPS somewhere on the screen because the LPS is in like really bad condition. And I'm planning to get another one, but I'm going to keep it because of memories. But it's so old and it's kind of damaged. So yeah, but that was the first LPS that I got. I actually didn't get the Dust Hound that was supposed to come with it. I'll show a picture of the Dust Hound that was supposed to come with it. But I only got that, so... I don't know if they made like sets where the Dutch Hound didn't come with it or if I did have the Dutch Hound. I have no idea, but it didn't come with the Dutch Hound, so I have no idea. Maybe I didn't have it or maybe I did. I have no idea, but yeah, that was my like favorite thing I got and definitely a memorable moment because I do remember that, so yeah. Question number 17. Do you make New Year's resolutions? Do you stick to them? No, I don't make New Year's resolutions. And probably if I did, I probably wouldn't stick to them. 
but kind of I make these things where I like say what I want to kind of learn this year or what I kind of want to work on this year. I wouldn't really like say it's a New Year's resolution, but I would just say it's like things I want to work on personally, like for myself or that I want to work on like and learn for this year. I wouldn't really call it a New Year's resolution, I guess. So yeah, I'll just call it like things I kind of like want to learn this year or things that I want to improve on, but I really wouldn't call them New Year's resolutions, so yeah. Question number 18, what makes the holiday special for you? Pretty much spending time with family, either talking to them or watching movies with them or just spending time with them. And the second thing would probably be like spending time with my friends because I don't get to spend a lot of time with my online friends. We don't get to call very much since they do have college. So on breaks, it is really, really great to, you know, call them and talk to them and watch movies with them and stuff like that. So I do enjoy both of those. Those are definitely special things for me during the holidays, so yeah. Question number 19. You have been granted one Christmas wish. What will it be? To meet all of my online friends as soon as humanly possible. Like right now would be a great time. But yeah, I really want to meet them. It is definitely one of my big dreams and one of my big wishes is to meet all of my online friends because I just really want to meet them. Like, I've talked to them and everything, but I just want to hug them. Like, please, can I hug them? I'll cry when I hug them, but I want to hug them. And, like, actually see them in real life instead of, a, like, a screen being in the way. But, yeah, I really do want to meet my online friends. Can we do, like, a little, like, thing like they do at cons where you just meet in a big area? We could have a meeting online friends party <laughs> like we could just have a little party with all of us like meeting each other but yeah it's definitely one of my big wishes I really hope one day it will come true but like if I had one Christmas wish that's definitely my Christmas wish so yeah okay so I'll put a photo somewhere on the screen of one of my favorite photos from this year's Christmas theme. I always do a Christmas theme every single year on my Instagram. So if you want to go see the rest of the photos, you guys definitely can. My Instagram is linked down below and you can definitely go check out the other photos that I did with this Christmas theme. But the one that I just showed you guys is my favorite from this year's Christmas theme. So yeah. So that is all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this tag video. I will put all of the questions down in the description if you guys want to do this tag as well. Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, and Happy Holidays to the people that don't celebrate Christmas. I hope you all have a safe holiday season. And if you guys don't celebrate any of those i hope you guys have a safe day and yeah so that is pretty much all and i will see you guys in the next video and i will also see you guys next year with brand new videos as well so bye guys please don't forget to rate comment subscribe and do the world pack and i will see you guys in the next video bye rose Arr!